Have you ever wondered what it's like to grow up as a royal, constantly in the public eye and second in line to the throne? Imagine the weight of centuries of tradition on your shoulders, the scrutiny of every action and the paradox of privilege and pressure. Today we explore The Spare, a memoir by Prince Harry that takes us through his journey, his struggles and his unique position within the British royal family. Join us as we delve into the life of Prince Harry, as told by the prince himself in his memoir, The Spare. The book begins with Prince Harry's early life and childhood. Born as the spare to the heir of the British throne, Prince Harry's arrival was a global event, his first breaths echoing in the hearts of millions. Yet behind the grandeur of royal life, we see a young boy navigating the complexities of a unique upbringing. The book paints a vivid picture of Harry's relationship with his family particularly his older brother William. While the two shared a strong bond, their paths were starkly different, and this divergence was a constant undercurrent in their relationship. Harry's relationship with his mother, Princess Diana, was also significant. She was a beacon of love and light in his life, fostering in him a deep empathy and a strong sense of justice. A series of significant events marked Harry's childhood, one of the most impactful was the untimely and tragic loss of his mother. This heartbreaking event played out in the public eye, deeply shaped his personality and outlook. The book also highlights the constant scrutiny Harry faced growing up. Every move, every word, every emotion was under the watchful eyes of the public and the press. This pressure, the book suggests, was a heavy weight on young Harry's shoulders. Harry's early life was anything but ordinary, setting the stage for the unique path he would later follow. As Harry grows older, he begins to grapple with his identity and his place in the royal family. Adolescence, a time of self-discovery and growth, proves to be a tumultuous period for Harry. The media spotlight, ever so glaring, becomes a source of constant pressure, adding to the complexities of his teenage years. He is no longer just a prince, he's a media sensation, a headline, a story waiting to be told. His mother's tragic death leaves a deep void in Harry's life. Princess Diana, the people's princess, was more than a royal figure to him. She was his mentor, his confidant, his guiding light. Her loss shakes him to the core, altering his perspective on life and royalty. It's a harsh awakening to the stark realities of his existence, one that propels him on a journey of introspection and self-analysis. Amidst this personal turmoil, Harry seeks solace in serving others, following his mother's footsteps. He joins the military, a decision that shapes his character and strengthens his resolve. The military life offers him an escape from his royal duties, a chance to be just Harry. It's a liberating experience, one that instills in him a sense of purpose and camaraderie. The battlefield is not just a place of conflict, but a platform for growth and transformation. Despite the intense scrutiny and personal struggles, Harry learns to navigate through the choppy waters of adolescence. He begins to question the traditional norms of royalty, yearning for a life beyond the castle walls. The experiences of his early adulthood stir in him a desire for independence, a need to carve out his own path. These experiences shape Harry's attitudes towards his royal duties. They instill in him a sense of responsibility, but also a deep desire for freedom. He begins to see the royal life not as a privilege, but as a cage, a gilded one, but a cage nonetheless. It's a realization that profoundly impacts his future decisions, setting the stage for the dramatic events to come. Amidst the challenges of young adulthood, Harry begins to question his role as the spare. The final chapters of Harry's memoir are a testament to his courage and determination. In these pages, we witness a pivotal moment in his life, his decision to step back from his royal duties. It's a choice that sends shockwaves across the world, but for Harry, it's the first step in a journey towards independence and self-discovery. This journey takes him across the Atlantic to a new home in the United States. In this unfamiliar landscape, far from the pomp and pageantry of royal life, Harry finds a sense of freedom. He's no longer bound by the weight of his title or the expectations that come with it. Instead, he's free to be himself to live a life that's authentic and true to who he is. But Harry's story doesn't end with his break from tradition. In his new life, he finds a new purpose. 
he turns his attention towards philanthropy, channeling his energy into projects that reflect his passions and values. He's now able to use his platform to make a difference in the world, to champion the causes he cares about, and to advocate for change. And as he reflects on his journey, Harry shares his insights and experiences with a candidness that's both refreshing and inspiring. He's honest about the challenges he's faced, the obstacles he's overcome, and the lessons he's learned along the way. He talks about finding happiness in unexpected places, about the power of authenticity, and about the importance of staying true to oneself. Harry's memoir is more than just a chronicle of his life. It's a story of transformation, of stepping out of the shadows and into the spotlight. It's about finding one's place in the world, about making a difference, and about forging one's own path, even when that path leads away from tradition and expectation. Harry's story is a powerful reminder that even in the face of tradition and expectation, one can forge their own path. His journey serves as an inspiration to us all, a testament to the power of courage, determination, and the will to chart one's own course. Prince Harry's memoir, The Spare, is more than just a royal biography. It's a gripping tale of independence, resilience, and authenticity, told through the eyes of a man who has lived under the relentless scrutiny of the public eye. The book's key takeaways are not just about the life of a prince, but also about the universal human experience. The Spare challenges our preconceived notions about royalty, showing us that being a prince is not all about glitz and glamour. It provides a unique perspective on the personal struggles faced by Prince Harry, from dealing with the death of his mother, Princess Diana, to his decision to break away from royal tradition. But perhaps the most powerful message of The Spare is its emphasis on the importance of self-determination. It's a story about a man who refused to let his title define him and instead chose to carve out his own path. In The Spare, Prince Harry invites us to see him not as a prince, but as a person. His story is a reminder that no matter who you are, you have the right to define your own life.